In this exam question, it comes to absorption and vapor pressure. Consider here a mixture of nitrogen and oxygen at 25 degrees Celsius and a total pressure of 1 bar in equilibrium with water. The temperature is lowered to 10 degrees centigrade and the pressure remains constant. That is an isobaric process. Discuss the change of the mole fraction of oxygen in the liquid phase and the change of the mole fraction of water in the gas phase. The absorption of oxygen in water is an exothermic process, which means this equilibrium shifts to the right with decreasing temperature. The solubility of oxygen increases with decreasing temperature. The evaporation of the water, however, is an endothermic process. That is, the equilibrium constant of this process, the vapor pressure, decreases with decreasing temperature, as can be calculated using clausius clapeyron's equation. If we lower the temperature, the oxygen content of the water increases, while vapor content in the gas phase decreases. We start from the same initial state and reduce the pressure to 0.5 bar. What impact does this have on the mole fraction of oxygen and the partial pressure of water? According to Henry's law, partial pressure and dissolved amount of gas are proportional. This means a lower pressure, the amount of oxygen in the water decreases. Vapor pressure, however, is substantially independent of the external pressure. Thus, it remains constant. Thanks for watching.